Okay, YouTubers. This week's video is going to be on dehydrating some banana, some bananas into banana chips. I know you're probably asking, why all the dehydrating videos? Well, dehydrating as a prepper, to me, is very important. I don't have a lot of money. I can't afford a lot of the freeze-dried or dehydrated prepackaged meals or foods, so I do a lot of it myself. So the first thing we'll do is we'll take this small pan, We've got two and a half cups of water, add just a little bit of lemon juice, it doesn't take very much. We want to avoid having the bananas turn brown after we cut them and before we dehydrate them. So I'll get busy here peeling and cutting and tossing them in that pan. You want to cut them about eighth of an inch you don't want them too thick they take too long to dry if you get them too thin they get extremely brittle and like all my other dehydrating videos if you can save the peels to add to your composter do so those add a lot of nutrients to your compost okay my bowl's about as full as i'm willing to get it this time to use a tray. Nope, not using my normal dehydrator. I'm going to use the solar dehydrator. So I'll load this tray and I'll show you what happens next. The last scoop. Hopefully I can get them all to fit. If not, I'll just eat them. Yeah, probably shouldn't crowd them that much. I'll have to take some off. Okay, next step, we're gonna go put this in the solar dehydrator. We had this much left over, so. Okay, you should dehydrate your bananas at about 135. Should take six to eight hours. Not real sure how long it'll take in this. We're right there, so I'm gonna add the tray. Okay, let's open this up. I probably should have used both trays and spread it out a little thinner, but I didn't, so we'll load our tray in, close it back up, hit the latches so the critters don't get in, take our food, and we'll check back on this later. So here we go, we got them in there, they're going. Not exactly sure how long it'll take, every day is different. We'll check back on these in a bit. I had forgot to open the vent after I put my banana chips in and it you can see all the moisture building up on the top. I just opened it and you can see it's, it's starting to clear out. Okay, so that vent has been open for five minutes and the condensation is now gone. Okay guys, it took a little bit longer than I expected, probably because I forgot to uh, move it around, point it towards the sun as often as I should have. So I'll pick these up, take them in the house, and show you what we have. I didn't film it, but I did uh, turn these over when I thought they were about halfway through. I was afraid that they'd get stuck to the screen, but they're nice and dry I'll try to get these in a jar put an oxygen absorber in there and label it before they get all ate up as you can probably imagine these are pretty tasty and they don't last long not around here so, load this jar Put 
put in some oxygen absorbers. Three 100 cc's. And then I'll seal it with the food saver. Use my wide mouth vacuum attachment on, for my food saver. Put it on and... <laughs> take this off so you don't break the seal put your ring on label it store it what's left in the bowl is not enough for a quart so I'll just leave these for the family to snack on hope you enjoyed <laughs>